Hello and welcome to another edition of the Sean Two Cents. I don't usually get on the webcam since I have a producer and all we do is interviews mostly. But I said, what the hell? I love doing previews and why stop? No one said stop, so I decided to get on here and tell you about Pros and Gorilla's 10th anniversary show, which it has announced all their matches tonight. I just want to go over all their matches right now and just have fun. And also, the show off my new Kevin Steen shirt. You know how much I love Kevin Steen. And to thank everybody for watching all the great videos of Ray Rosas and the Shots version version 2.0 episode 1. So for watching all the new videos and supporting us, the Shots and Scott Mitchell just from Hollywood. So that's awesome. And the great work by Drew Pony. Andrew, you're awesome. But I did but I still want to get on the webcam maybe once or once every two weeks and just still do this. Because this is why well the shots are bread on. I don't want to forget this. So let's go do it. Pro Secret presents 10, August 9th. Takes us on until July 9th. Get gonna keep her right really fast for that. Yeah, front row. And don't be matched. It's gonna be a six-man tag featuring so SoCal's finest. The people that work for so for, work for PWG or 2011, 2012. We haven't seen in a while. It's gonna feature Kenneth Array, Willie Mack, B-Boy, Ryan Taylor, and more. I hope it is PP Ray, famous B. So we don't know who we can see. This is gonna be awesome, awesome show. The show of PG people, how how much better. People like Candice Array and Ryan Taylor and Mac have gotten. I know Bully Mac and B-Boy have been there, but B-Boy is new and approved, and Peter needs to see how new and approved he is. This opening match is going to really start the show with a bang. They are going to have Paul Lennon and, Ken and Brian Kendrick making their Peter G return to face Junior Gallon and Chuck Taylor. Oh my god, that's a dream match right there. To see Leonard Kendrick together? I've never seen that live. I've never seen that live. That will buy the ticket right there. Oh my god, Leonard Kendrick with Gary and Taylor. Does he see those two teams work together? We have the veterans or the young guys. People say Lauren Kendrick versus the Young Bucks is a dream match. This might be a second up there. Man, Fist versus them? Oh my god, this is going to be a show stealer. Then we got Kyrie versus Team Perkins. Perkins. Another show stealer. O'Reilly just got over with the crowd last show. He's going to be more over and just putting over another guy like TJ. It's going to be great. This is going to be a great technical matchup. It's going to be a show stealer there. Then we're going to have Brian Cage versus Dave Richards. My God, this is gonna be a good damn match. Aaron Fox is Michael Elgin. Man, how 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 many how many seconds is he gonna put Elgin up, a uh, Fox up for? How many times is he gonna throw Fox? And then Rocky Bro and Alex Kozlov are gonna make their return to PWG to face the Rottenest Monsters. That's gonna be an intriguing matchup. I've seen Robert Kozlov a few times. They've been great champions in Japan, and Rotten Monsters been in Japan too. We we're going to see the, the veterans Roman Kozlov versus other monsters. We know Rotten Monsters can do it. So this will be a good match to test Rotten Monsters. And it should be an interesting matchup that we haven't seen before. It's going to be real cool. Then in the WWE event, we're going to have a three-way ladder match between the Young Spender titles against the Dojo Bros, Roger Strong, and Eddie Edwards versus Ricochet and Rick Swann, the Industry Machine Guns, for the PG World Top. My God, it's going to be more crazy than last year. Because Ricochet and Rick Swann can fly, fly, or high flyers, unlike... Future Shock and SSB last year. They weren't high flyers. And I say the Energy Machine Guns win and take those PG World titles. But I, I was on Wrestling Heads earlier and they made a good point that Ricochet was on always in Japan, so it'll make more sense that JoJo Bros take the titles. And they've been building JoJo Bros. They're 1 and 2 in their, in their wrestling as JoJo Bros. So, yeah. So we'll see. I think the MX will, will lose, these, lose the titles in the latter match. I think they will. Then we have for PG World title, Adam Cole versus Drake Younger. It's going to see a World War match. This is the match to take the title off Adam Cole and put on Drake Younger. Drake Younger, I've been, been at Wrestle Care Saturday. I was at Ideal Friday. He is over like a motherfucker. When his music hits, you see Drake, Drake, Drake. Little kids and I, straight Drake, Drake. Goes all the way up this. From the, from the old lady in the back to the five year old in the front, it is Drake, 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 Drake. Oh my god, Drake Younger is so fucking over, it's crazy. It's like fucking Stone Cold Steve Austin The Rock here in the SoCal. He is so over, it's ridiculous. And you gotta put the title on him. You gotta. Adam Cole is a heel, and he gets no fucking reaction. I know he's supposed to be hated, but he gets no really reaction. You put the title on Drake Younger, then maybe a Bola, Younger, and Cole fight. But I say put the title on Younger people. And also, August 31st, we battle the Battle of LA. And their first two enters, ACH and Trip Renner. People hate on Trip Renner. He's part of Super Juniors. And last last Peter Jones did, please don't come back. So we'll see 
How the crowd reacts to him come back? An ACH and a PWG ring? That is money. Now, the government needs to know why uh, PWG prints this money, man. I know it's kind of rusty doing this, and it's also fucking hot in LA. I live here in California, it's fucking hot as hell, so sweating up and stuff. And also, LSA this uh, Sunday. Another thing I got a plug because it's a new promotion. They present Feet in the fr Fight. It'll be July 7th at 5 p.m. They're going to have a four elimination match to decide that was not the number one contender in the main event. It'll be El Chito out Cutter Canals for Dre Russell versus Buffy B. Biggs versus a wrestler. Two hands that day. That's an excellent four way. Then we have the Banderas members. I heard they were very good. Versus the Iron Curtain, Sasha Drake members, and Shea Cabrera. Big things for Sasha and Trey coming up. A lot of good things for Sasha coming up. And also, he's on my interview you can watch after this. Did Dean and Virus Rick Sadis? Or 66 for the Feed of Avengers, which is Pinky and Fabian Fury. Then the main event, and Sipping event will be uh, William Mack versus Tyler Baven. Then the LC LSA champion, Marion Jerry Mandel, plays Bell Line against the winner of the opening contest. This will be a fucking great match. Great show, really. Ten bucks, people. Ten bucks, people. Man, it should be a great way to get out of the hot weather. It is getting a nice air conditioning place and just have a fun time. So great great young talent here. So yeah. So as always watch all of our videos, make sure to subscribe and shit. And this will be and I'm just grateful that this all has happened. Sean says great. Thank you guys for supporting us and tweeting us. So the Sean says can get better. And if you want if you like Marty's previews, might like the video and tell me you want Marty's previews. Okay. <laughs> I know I am more rusty a little bit, but I'm excited. That's all. I'm excited for all this stuff. So Peter G August 9th, and then we got uh, July 7th. You got LSA, and also have happy for July people, Independence Day people.